show you said please help control the pet population please have your pet spayed or neutered yes I'm just wondering how you got involved with that organization and how many pets and what kind of pets do you have well uh, one thing at a time uh, I have uh, one dog Jessie she's a shelter dog that's the only place to get an animal yeah. and, uh, she was, uh, she's part child and part uh, golden retriever and uh, I was told when I adopted her, she was about five, I've had her four years, and she's uh, about nine years old now, and uh, we go for a long walk every morning, and she has friends all over the neighborhood, Leroy, Clancy, uh, one after another. I know all the dogs' names, and I don't know the people. <laughs> I've seen them frequently, and we never think to, you know, who are you and who are you? And it's just, oh, here comes Leroy, hello, Leroy. Oh, here's Samson, say hello to Samson. And uh, on the Spain Interplug, the reason I started doing that, I did that probably for, uh, I was on the show 35 years, I probably did that 25 years or more. And the reason is that overpopulation is one of the most tragic problems, so far as animals are concerned, that we have in the United States. And in the world, as a matter of fact. There are just too many cats and dogs born for all of them to have home. There are people all over the country who are devoting their time, their energy, and their money to trying to find homes for all of these animals, and they're doomed to failure because the homes don't exist. And the obvious and the only answer is to have your pet spayed or neutered. So I started doing that on Prices Right now. I have, uh, now I have a, a, a foundation named in memory of my wife, Dorothy Jo, and in memory of my mother. Her name was Matilda, but everybody called her Tilly. So I named the foundation DJMT Foundation. And this foundation uh, subsidizes spay neuters for people who can't afford it for their animals all over the United States. We work through local organizations, and we have... Uh, at least one in every state of the union, but we have multiple uh, organizations in most states that are, uh, that are doing this. And uh, incidentally, all of the profits of uh, this book of mine, Priceless Memories, if there are any profits, and there will be, it's a bestseller, there will be, there will be, there will be I still can't believe it, but uh, there will be profits, and all of the profits go to the DJ&T Foundation. So, The more books I hustle today, the more space and news we'll be doing.